time for the moment you've been waiting for. Preparing the Krabby Patty. Good morning, Efforta. My name's Alex. And I'm here. Today is Thursday, March 23rd, 2023. Please rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to that flag. MTS will only be open during period two today. But in other news, have you ever been to a military base? The counseling office will be taking any interested students on a field trip to Fort Indian Town Gap on April 27th. During the visit, you will have a chance to learn about how the military can help pay for your college. Full tuition. Try out multi-million dollar simulators like rifle range, tank operator, troop carrier, Flight simulator, striker multi-person vehicle, and even eat an MRE, so meal ready to eat, for lunch. We went last year and the students who attended loved it. This trip is open to all 9th through 12th graders. If you are interested, please be sure to sign up ASAP using the link in Schoology. Mark your calendars, prom goers. Grace Fellowship Church is having a Gowns with Grace event this Saturday, March 21st. March 25th, high school students can come select prom gowns and other formal attire to wear for prom at no cost. Now, for a prom announcement, then over to Bog Daddy with the news. Attention juniors and seniors, are you ready for a night under the sea at prom 2023? Come out and join us for a night of food, fun, and dancing, Saturday, April 22nd from 6 to 10 at the Doubletree Reading. Tickets are $70 a person and tickets will be on sale in the eLab the last week in March, Tuesday through Friday. Please look at the flyers around the school for the times. For more information and guest forms, please see Mrs. Wellman in the main office or me, Mrs. Petrie, in room 200. When coming to buy tickets, please come with your entire table of eight in order to be guaranteed to sit together. Each student must have all obligations paid and come with a valid student ID to purchase a ticket. I know your mom is going to ask, so checks can be made out to EASD with your name in the memo line. The only students that will be purchasing a ticket without being present will be students that are bringing a non-EHS guest student. If you are bringing a guest from outside the school, please make sure all forms are filled out completely and you have a photocopy of their ID printed out at the time of ticket purchase. We hope to see you there. Mmm, this is gourmet! World Math Day is on March 23rd, and we're counting on you to show up. Flex those big brain of yours. Um, yeah, math is beautiful and all around us, but some people's palms just get sweaty, eyes weak, and arms just heavy just thinking of math. If this is you, you're not alone. And it's okay. World Math Day hopes to change everyone's mind and aims to change the irrational fear of math into a fa lifelong fascination. Also, Minecraft news. Minecraft update 1.20, aka the Trails and Trail Tales update, is dropping some new features such as the new sniffer mob and also the new camel. It also features armor trimming and archaeology. There are also new cherry blocks, trees, cherry trees, bamboo blocks, and hanging signs. Get mining, crafters. Now back to the main desk. Pay attention any underclassmen like myself. Please take a few minutes to review your course requests for next year by logging into your PowerSchool portal. You can access these requests by clicking on the class registration item under the navigation menu on the left, where you're, you pick your courses. If everything looks good, you are done. If you would like to change a non-teacher recommended course, just have your parent message your counselor 
with the courses that you would like to add and or drop. If you would like to switch a teacher recommended course, be sure to complete a yellow teacher recommendation change form available from the counseling office or the counseling office webpage. All change requests need to be made by March 31st. If you have any questions, reach out to your counselor ASAP. On Tuesday, April 4th, the Friends of Rachel's will be ha hosting an afternoon with games after school in the Media Center. Come join us from 3 to 4. There will be card and board games provided by the Media Center, and you are welcome to bring your own games, too. If you have any questions, please stop by Mrs. Hall's room 121 or send Mrs. Hall's school G message. We hope to see you there. Now, we have a never before seen ad from Ephrata AM. Hey, you there. So you like school? <laughs> yeah, me neither. Well, we have a solution for you. Introducing Ephrata on Tamer Radio. Or for those who don't know, Ephrata AM. No more awkward thoughts while waiting for the bell to ring. No more falling asleep in first period because you are up past your bedtime. Effort AM is basically like drugs. Once you pop, you can't stop. Addiction? But that sounds bad. Well, this addiction is good for you. Effort AM is the perfect start to your day. It tells you about upcoming school events and general information. It catches you up on the latest news and any sports info you might not have known. Don't forget about word of the day and lunch. But if you're still not convinced, we asked these unpaid actors their thoughts on Effort at AM. These are their responses. Effort at AM? What is that? It's the, it's the morning news. We have a morning news? What's the deal with Effort at AM? Why is there always some kid playing truck driver games on the back of this TV screen? What? You play a news station every morning. Okay, you can Google that information on the internet. Why is there always this junior that's just staring at the camera as everyone else talks and acts like it's normal and then occasionally showcases his bald head? Very bizarre. Wouldn't recommend. We have it all at Ephrata AM. It's, it's just, just one, one click away. away. Ephrata AM is not responsible for death, dismemberment, or destruction of property. Side effects may include vomiting, nausea, headaches, migraines, depression, cancer, and having a dumb, stupid face. Batteries not included. Hello, my name is Teleprompter, and we have 13 seconds to record this. We have French toast sticks, bacon egg extravaganza bowl, French bread pizza, Italian hoagie, crispy popcorn chicken salad, and a fruit and yogurt parfait with a muffin. Hello there. General Kenobi! Yesterday, tennis won 7-0 at Lebanon. Todd Weiss came back from a first set loss to win, and Isaac Musser won his second set after a five-game tie. Boys Lacrosse won their opener versus Muhlenberg 15-3. Landon Sierran was the top scorer with five goals for the Mounts. Volleyball won 25-15, 25-17, and 25-19 for Schuylkill County last night. Today, tennis is home versus Red Lion, and Meet the Mounts is at 7 p.m. tonight at the EMS gym. Now back to the main desk. Students will go to period four for act today. Have a great day, Africa. Nah, nah, nah.